Hello, all you coin aficionados out there, and welcome to our third edition of African Coin Monday, where we look at coins from the continent of Africa. We have not done many coins from Africa, and we've been asked to do more coins from Africa, so we've added every other Monday morning. We have an additional video come out that has just African coins only. So same thing we'll do that we always do. Take my little tea jar, open it up, dump it out, and let's look through the coins. So we've got all kinds of different coins here. I know a couple people want me to do that coin there from Namibia, um, but let's kind of look through them and see if we can find one that I would like to do today. Oh, I'll try this one. What is this? Okay, this is a 10 franc coin, so we know that's probably from one of the French, uh, the former French colonies. Um, and which one is it? Anybody got any idea? 10 francs. All right, let's make it a little lower. I would see all that food and stuff around the outside. Um, let's turn it and we will see. Ah, so this is a 10 franc coin from 1984 from, it says around the outside, it says Bank of the Afrique Centrale, Central Bank, uh, essentially Central African Republic Bank, um, or Central African States Bank, that's what I mean. So it turns out that there are a number of countries who when uh, they got their independence from France, banded together to have a joint currency. And this is an example of that currency uh, from the Central African states. And uh, sometimes it's called the BEAC, B-E-A-C. Uh, and this is called a CFA franc or CFA 10 franc. Um, the countries are Chad, Republic of the Congo, Gabon, Cameroon, and Equatorial Guinea. And they all share a common coinage. All right, so let's look at this particular coin. This particular coin has three giant elands on here. And you can see the horns on these. They're much like an, a huge antelope or very, very strong antelope. I look right in there in the grasses. See, they're in the, the grasses or maybe on the savanna. It's hard telling. We see the engraver's initial right in there. See the big C around the outside and the R in the middle right. Let me see if I can line that up. So it's right here, and that's the engraver's initials, and it's Robert Cochet. So Cochet is the big C, and inside that is Robert, the R. Okay. When we look up the side here, we also see that there is a uh, another engraver's uh, initial up here, and that is Gabriel Bernard. And. Lucien Gorges Bazor. So we have Bernard and Bazor here, and we have Cochet here. Kind of a really nice way to do it. Not very intrusive, and it kind of, the, the way they set the design up, it fits their initials and names in very well. So again, this is um, a 1984 coin. It is made of aluminum and bronze, it has a smooth edge. And we t turn it over and we see again what we saw at the beginning. It's 10 francs. It's uh, just all different kinds of food and um, plant life. This is um, minted at Monet de Paris, and so it has a dolphin on it here. Uh, this particular coin, there were 16 million of these made in 1984, and the mintages went by year um, eight, 18 for a while, then four, then, I mean, it's really bounced up and down, really depending upon demand. This coin was made from 1974 to 2003. The um, Central African states do not share a government, they simply share a currency and this, that's what we have here today. So thanks again for coming and watching the DC Coin World International Coin Channel. This is our 
African Coin Monday edition number three, and that is the Central African States 10 francs coin, or the BIAC 10 francs coin, or the CFA 10 francs coin. Please feel free to subscribe to our channel, and if you have any comments or any videos you'd like us to do, please leave them in the comments section. Have a great day.